Hello and welcome to the K5 Championship Season 5, or should I say Season 5B, <laughs> the original plan for the 87 Legends on short tracks didn't quite work out, so instead we've got the Kern County Season here. And uh, right now we're in the Super Late Model, first ever time I've done a race in the Super Late Model, I just bought it earlier today and am giving it a go. Um, feeling okay. I actually really like how it drives. So that's good. Everything's good there. But this season, we are going to be checking out the new Kern County Raceway in a variety of different cars, not just the super late model. Explain more after qualifying here. Don't hit that wall. I almost hit the wall and it kind of slowed me down a little bit. One more lap. Trying to get as much as I can though. Sixth place. Not sure how it's going to go. That was really slow through one and two. Oh, I'm spinning it. Okay. I guess I'll take that. I'm in the point ones. Uh, that first lap was in the point one, so uh, good enough. You can see the fastest guys are down there in the O's, but um, not gonna be too concerned. I'm happy with that. My first ever time racing this car. But this season, season five, we're gonna be taking a variety of different cars here to Kern County, starting with the super late model, and we're gonna move on to cars like the Tour Mod, I believe, is one of them. We're going to do an Enduro race, is what it's being called, where we get the, the Clio, the MX, Mazda MX-5, and the Toyota GR86 uh, road cars. And we race around here for a while, which should be very fun. I'm looking forward to that one. And it all leads up to the finale in the Xfinity cars out here. It's all going to be Kern County, enjoying the new track, which seems to be a really fun one. I've enjoyed my uh, races in, at Kern County so far. And uh, seeing how it races in a bunch of different cars. So that'll be K5 Championship Season 5, B. <laughs> and uh, a little bit of a shorter season. We're going, I think, just six races. Which I think is going to be more the trend heading forward. Of course, you've got uh, a lot of the fastest guys you would expect up front here. Guys like uh, Chris, Mitch, Tracy, and Cabe. Cabe specifically. Not too surprising to see him on pole right now because he races in real life at Kern County. Like, he's uh, the the out there eight. winning races probably <laughs> at Kern County in real life. Um, and... Uh, yeah, he was already fast to begin with, so give him home field advantage, home track advantage. Uh, he's going to be a tough one to beat, probably all season. So we'll see what we can do, though. Starting from P8, it looks like. I'm happy with that. Moving down the list here, you see uh, other fam familiar names. We got Wesley, going to start directly behind us. Uh -oh. In the row behind. Just going through. Daniel's here today. Good luck to him. The crew chief. <laughs> no, this is fixed setup, so we're all on e equal playing field in that regard. Nick right next to his dad starting off. That's buddy. funny. 22nd and 23rd. Gavin, I'm surprised, good. down there in 25th. He's been having trouble with qualifying lately, though. Um, he yeah, uh, he had, you know, a, fast times in practice. He was in the ones, but he found himself with a point four there. And, uh, no matter, though, everybody makes the race. We've got 30 people here today. And uh, let me get in the car, because people might be waiting on me. <laughs> You're on the outside this time. Pit road is closed. So we can't quite make it on fuel, it looks yeah, like. Hey, Daniels, my car's Two sets away. of tires. Keep it clean. The DNF today would hurt our points a lot. It's going to be a tough challenge. No, you're currently an iRacing 2. <laughs> It's going to be a tough challenge, because this is a brand new car for me. There okay, could be okay. some handling characteristics I don't expect once we get to long run. More than anything, I just want to keep it steady, 
right in front of me. Not trying to get too much. And enjoy the drive. I think this is going to be a really I fun like season. Good. There are two so two to green. Only two sets of tires for 200 laps. So we've got to be smart about how we use those. Follow car number 18. Had some people having some issues with their trading paints. I haven't noticed anything. Um, but then again... I haven't really paid too much attention, but yeah, like Tracy looks normal up there. About I don't have 13. any uh, trading paints. I, mean, I don't have like a trading paints car for this, so um, I just got the i racing scheme. Cave up there looks normal, so I guess everything's good. I think it was mostly the numbers people were having issues with. Like their car would say one thing, and then on the relative down here would say something else. 15. I'm not sure what that's all about, but. What gear are we starting in? I've never had to launch with this car. So that's going to be interesting all on its own. It looks like second gear should be fine. Looks like we can gas it up without too much issue. I like how this drives, though. Um, I'm new to the car, but it's... I like everybody has fun. Just remember, this track does have a tendency to kind of wash up if you're on the bottom. So just make it smart. Everybody has fun. It's, uh, it's been some good fun. I like that it has a little bit of power. So you have to kind of use some throttle control. It's been it's been an uh, enjoyable experience learning how to drive it. I somehow get hit already and killed. What happened there? Did not. Did somebody not listen to what I said? Yeah, someone definitely came off the bottom. Pit road is now open. I caught it. Well, that didn't start off very well. That point, I was just smart. Wait for the 32. Out. It looked like someone just came up and got me. Like I was just minding my own business. Nick gained about four spots out of that. I think Neben got caught up in that too. I hope we're okay. Did take a bit of a hit, and now we're all the way at the back. He's okay, he's right in front of me. A 20 car spun back up after the wreck was over, or at least I, it was the 20 car in my view. Who knows who it was? No idea what happened there. I don't think I did anything wrong. I was just heading into the corner, and all of a sudden someone tagged my left rear, it felt like. Yeah, they spun right up in front of me. I just barely missed them. One left to green. I'll just have to take a look at that later, I guess. Hopefully I didn't do anything wrong, like didn't wasn't too far down. Or anything like that. But there goes our qualifying effort. <laughs> Get ready, going green. The pace car is in. It's like we're uh getting Bit of an accordion, maybe, here. I'm not in a hurry. I think they're possibly going to wreck again. I don't know what my car is doing. The next car is Vincent. Thanks, Alan. Fastest lap for the car outside. Clear outside if you want it. Just gonna take it easy, stick to the bottom. Seems like the car's okay. Obviously, we took a bit of a hit, but it wasn't a big, huge one. So that's good. Oh, I saw some smoke for a second. Whoa, Shane getting really loose. 
That lap time was 18.6. That's your quickest lap in this session. Outside. Don't knock it out Clear up, top. Get to the bottom, get the apron a little bit. That lap time was 18.8. It's going to be patient. Long race here. Plenty of time to make our way back up forward. And uh, the less damage we do to the car, the better. That was a loose on exit. Oh man, he's cutting in front of us there. Oh my gosh, and then hitting the brakes hard. Cut me off guard a little bit. Clear. So I got up to you, I you drank just a little bit. Car outside. Still there, hold your line. B24 Clear. Was a 18 .9. Clear, we got somebody in a wreck. Stopping on the track as a lap car. Don't do it. Don't stop on the track, please. <laughs> it looked like he was going to. That lap was a 18.7. The car in front has just posted up. Guess not. I guess we're okay. So, so far so good. We've moved forward a little bit. Working on being gentle on the inputs. Oh, in the wall. Ahead. We're good. We're good, though. Still there. Keep low. Outside is clear. 22nd place. And get around Alan there. Car still feels good. Still don't think that damage did much to us, which is a nice sigh of relief. Because we can try to get the track position back, but we can't get our car back to immaculate conditions if it's uh, damaged too much, so I'll definitely uh, take that bit of good news. And caution. We're slowing it down, don't know what we're going to find around this point. Car is out. All right. Up single file behind car number 88. Let's see here. The road is now open. Full course yellow. It's We'd have to make it to about lap 60 if we wanted to make it up to the end on fuel. So that's important to remember. Stinks that this set of tires we have on now has been through a slide, and that we probably have some damage, but not the end of the world. Didn't see what happened at all, in terms of any wrecks or anything. Did they say every one of these are going to be fixed set up? Car 2, got the lucky dog, let them pass on the outside. Yeah, everyone is on the same setup. Let that two. Not say every on. week. Oh yeah, yeah you did. Alright, got the lucky dog coming around. I imagine it's gonna be too green here. I guess it wouldn't have been unless Nick Short did it. Somebody did that. The 27 lap car that we're all coming by, it looks like. Yeah, 
team or no team, I don't have the skill set to run with them up front on fixed door open. So we're 22nd, pretty far back. I'll show you a few better ones. We are having a hard time at the end of this line. That's okay, feeling alright. I'll be starting on the outside, unfortunately. Though you can really get away with that here if you are in that second lane. I think the second lane actually is faster, so. Not really too bad of a draw here. You might even say you would prefer to be on the outside, but hard to tell quite yet. Big check up into the corner. I don't want to go three wide, but he's really far up the track there. Just kind of stuck right now. Go, I guess we'll go inside. Car outside. Still there. Clear, clear, clear. Still there. Go low. Clear high. Clear high. Car outside. Oh my gosh, very close to our quarter Still panel there. there. People don't know how to hit the brakes, so we get ran into the back of. It's going to be able to slow down in time, but we just get slammed into. <sighs> Things aren't going too well for us. Well, I had nowhere to go. They probably couldn't see it, though. So that's understandable. <laughs> Gavin's got my paint scheme of all people. Wish I wasn't back here to begin with, but nothing we could do about that either. I swear I didn't take it. Steve. We're going to come fix damage and uh, take some tires, but I don't think we can right now because we're not cut up to the field for some reason. So hopefully it'll still be open next time around. I really wish we would catch up more. Guess that's better. We want to take our tires. It's still pretty early for that, I think, so no, we won't do that. But we will take fuel, and we will try to fix some damage, I think. Because we've been hit a couple times now. Full course yellow. Pits are open. Pit lane speed limit is 35 miles per hour. Very interesting pit lane here. Very sharp turn into here. It's almost kind of hidden. Five, three, two, one. We'll right assess our here. damage. We can only repair some of the damage. can only repair some of it, unfortunately. Gotta make sure that go, go, go. engine's on, so it doesn't turn it off automatically like it likes to do. They want you in single file. On out. Ninety-two, on the rights. Twenty-two car. Hang on, we're not going green. Not going green. Delay green. Guys, stopping. I assume up there. Not much we can do about that. Got some damage fixed though. That's good. One to go. Next time by. We're going green. Next time by. Oh boy. 
Let's hope we don't end up hit in something again. I don't know how we can prevent that, though. I really like uh, Michael's best pro shop scheme. That's a classic. Get ready. Going green. The pace car is off. Be ready. A little bit of an accordion effect. Green, 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 green. Let's go. Kinda going. V23. Mm, really slow down here. Spinning. They want you in single file. Sorry, I was on the break and started I could I didn't mean to go down the line up single file behind And we'll go behind the three again. This really doesn't need to be this way. I really hope this series doesn't turn into another wreck fest. It really doesn't need to be. Where is the pace car in relation to us? Really need these guys to scoot up. Watch your speed. Watch your speed limit in the pits. Okay. We'll need to stop again. No tires. Three, two, one. Right here. We can only repair some of the damage. Next guy start. Start. Gotta get begin irritated. Repairs are almost finished up. Was well, this our fourth caution? All clear. Punches. Thirty-four laps. Dante, you're asking me if you have right front damage? They want you in single file. Catch that, 32. Car, pass that, 27. Car, one left. As fast as I can, trying to get caught back up. Come to my side. Must find the right one, fine. I don't know what they're doing. I don't know why you would sit side by side to let people by. They appreciate waiting on, on me, but... Why would you block the whole track? I need a little bit of coordination there, I think. The pace car is off. Be ready. Green flying, green, green. Inside. Be twenty one. Stay high. There's a car on the low side. Still inside. Clear inside. God. Brakes early. Still there inside. You okay? Car just blew up. I don't know what happened. Wheel it around here, buddy. We'll get three tires on there. I'll take a look at it. And get up to the bumper. No boo. Oh my goodness. Well, that sucks. Car outside. It's got to be careful getting around, guys. Do you know why we just blow up? Was we not hitting nothing? Clear. You've just done it, 18.7. Okay, up to 18th now. Only thing I would think is if you had fun and damage, but if you didn't hit anything, that's very just done it. The only thing I hit, Gavin, was the gate. Stay low. There was a car on the high side. Clear high. Yeah, Clear. that's really weird. I don't know. That sucks. B17. The lap time was at 18.8. I think I have his top 10 shadow. Got the 32 behind us, he's a lap down or more. So hopefully he'll give us some patience. Tyler falling backward, it looks like. See the one that was in 14th? The lap before, and then it's now 16th? Maybe. See so have some damage? Still there at the bottom. 
stay high, there's a car on the low side. Still there. Oh my god, why? Still there at the bottom. Just done a 19.0. Still inside. <laughs> okay. Clearing We're good. Clear. Just trying to be careful. Got guys in the wall in front of us. And yeah, guys in the wall in our head. Stuck weird? on the outside. V16. That was an outside. Yeah, that's really great. Why is he sticking his nose on the outside of us? What is your problem, dude? Back off. You're lap down. Still there, hold your line. Fifteenth place. Still there, hold your line. Yeah, Maybe I'm just I'm complaining, I don't know. Up here. Trying to safely get my way around some of these guys though, and it's not easy when a guy's sticking his nose on the exit of the corner on the outside. It's a little annoying. Finally got some open track ahead of us. Hopefully we can hit some good laps. Okay, Colton. The next car is Taylor. Some loose on exit. Probably got to ease up on that. Car stopped ahead. Smoke. Car stopped ahead, but looks like it might be clear. If this guy wrecks me, I'm going to be pissed. I'm just going to say that. Like, we're just trying to have fun here, but there's absolutely no reason for this guy to be racing me right now. Needs to be said about that. The gap behind is now 0.9. So we just gotta hope for another uh, caution, I suppose. Probably about time to start getting fuel. I think we might be able to make it to the end if it goes green. I think we got to get to about lap 60 probably for that to be possible. But it's getting pretty close. The lap time was at 18.8. He wants to door me. As a lap car battling me for no reason, then I want him out of my race. Glad he saved it, because I was supposed to I was just trying to push him out of the way. He got more sideways than I expected, but I'm not dealing with that. That's some BS. That's some official racing garbage that I don't want to deal with. I'm trying to have fun here. Maybe he has an explanation, I don't know. That's my explanation. I've already been run into a couple times now, and I'm just, uh, my patience is short, I guess. I don't know, maybe I'm the villain, whatever. But we are in 15th, we are through 57. Plenty more to go. And uh, we'll see if we can catch at all here. We got 3.2 in front of us. We've had to slide these tires around multiple times from getting hit. So I'm sure the tires are not great. We haven't been able to change them at all. 
Next time uh, we get a caution, if we do get another one, we might not get another one, but if we do get another one, we'll definitely be changing them, I think. Uh oh. There's a wreck. Oh no, it's Gavin. That sucks. We can see lemons have spun off. No, the guy in front of me did, and then just instantly stopped the car, and we all died. Well, we'll get our fuel and tires for sure. Is Gavin still stuck down there? Oh no, is he KO'd? Yeah, it looks like this track needs some work. What happened? There's an issue with the track? The gate. I remember someone saying something about the gate. Huh, there might be something weird going on with the collision with that. I'm not sure what they're talking about. I haven't heard anything about that, but it sounds like maybe the gate sticks out farther than it should. Or at least the collision for it does. What a weird pit road this is. We can only repair some of the damage. Well, I just got screwed on the pit. All right, let's get these tires changed. I'm not even in a pit stall, so I didn't know where I was supposed to be. Wow, the pit too far right. tire changing is slow. Come on, come on, come on. Move it, move it. Oh, we barely got out in time. That's crazy. They want you in single file. Okay, what we got? 78, 78 was the right sides after sliding a whole bunch. In a much better position now, though, than we were. Let's see if we can get back into this thing. Car's going to the back, it looks like. E14s will be on the outside, which, again, really not a bad thing. It seems like that's just fine here. I think it, it just all depends on what momentum the line you're in has, feels like. I got the wave around here. Three, two, stopping. On track. Tell me to let 20 by 20 come in. Next time by, you're on the outside this time. Race the regime at the end of this one. Not going green. Not going green. Hang on. We're not going green. We're not going green. We're not going green. We got to fix up scoring, it looks like. Yeah, if you got waves, you got to go. This is the 80 car. I don't know, tell me to stay behind the 22, but they're not going either. Never mind. Pass the 18 car. One left to green. I'm supposed to let this guy by? Well, I'm going to get a black flag, I guess. I don't know what's going on here. I'm going to... So I've got a safe on him. A bunch of us are gonna get black. I'm about to get a black. I imagine with the scoring issues this time, he'll probably clear it. So I just line up where you're supposed to, and then it'll most likely get cleared. A lap of the to go green. Go Stay focused. Stuff. Hang on, we're not going green. Not going green. Oh boy, what kind of nonsense is happening green. here? Not going green. There must be all kinds of scoring issues. I think we might be good now, though. All 
right, Colton. Get ready. Race will resume at the end of this lap. Pace car is out. Line up single file behind car 2008. I'm in eighth, but I see my car in second. <laughs> Doesn't help, I don't know who's who because the paints are messed up. What a mess. What a mess. About to go green. Stay focused. Hopefully everything's good. Inside. Inside. Clear. Someone's doing flips back there. Looks like somebody else caught that cage again and just flipped upside down. It's it's a gate or something? It's open. Any way to get a message to Nick for black flags? Maybe on Discord, if he's looking at it. Other than that, you just gotta hope he sees it. Yeah, because if you pee in, then it still won't show up, so... Car, 32. Got the lucky 32 dog. gets lucky dog. That really stinks he didn't clear the black flags. I really thought he would. Clear it after how much uh, confusion there was. Pace car is out. Pits are closed. There it goes. Hey. Nice. Okay, I'm glad he did that because it seems like there was a lot of guys that didn't deserve to have black flags. Yeah, I don't know if it's a problem with Colton in there or just the black flags going on or what happened there or if it's a track deal, but. At least he recognized it. Catch the 17 car. Get ready, going green. Post car is off. Can we get some more green flag running in here? I'm a bit messy so far, but we've had some decent runs. Oh, that got loose. Just trying to do the cut down there. Smoke up ahead, someone I think got the wall. That lap time was 19.1. Outside. Stay low. There is a car on the high side. Outside is clear. Thirteenth place. That lap was at eighteen point five. Just done at 18.4. Good luck. That's your quickest today. Inside. Keep high. Still there at the bottom. Clear. Oh, big loose for Nick. You've just done it. I'm in trouble seeing where guys are running. Inside. So little view in this car. I feel like freaking Oppenheimer looking at the nuclear bomb test through the tiny little porthole. That's what this windshield is. There's no, there's no visibility at all. Kind of crazy. B12. That lap was at 18.7. Sorry about that, Alan. Really hard to get a run out of the corner too, because it really wants to get loose on you when you try to kind of cut down. Clear. 
All right, we've been moving our way forward. There goes Gavin. That really stinks. This car definitely got KO'd by whatever that gate issue was. Oh, I overdrove that bad. There was no grip all of a sudden. Ugh. All right, well, he gets to our inside again. We'll let him go. It's our mistake. trouble figuring out exactly how hard I can drive this thing. Driving it, I'm trying to be consistent, but sometimes it grips and sometimes it doesn't. Just trying to get familiar with the car, I suppose is all that is. Ooh, Chad, a little sideways there. Heels onto it though, no problem. Oh my god. Okay, it tried to snap on me. I just need to be smoother right now and figure this car out a little bit more. Because I think uh, the handling is starting to switch up a little bit on me. On these longer runs and I'm not quite ready for it. That was a 18.6. Oh, sorry, Rick. Or whoever was in front of us. Frank. Alright, I saved it. Ooh, some smoke. Feeling a little bit better now. I was just getting a little bit too excited on throttle on exit, I think is what it was. Yeah, I barely touched you. Really getting me unsettled. I'm about two seconds behind us. So we're okay there, no pressure from behind. You've just done a 18.7. Someone's in the wall, I think that might have been Chad. And a caution. Make it down because I can't see around the corner. I'm really sorry about that, Rick. Looks like we're okay. We only have one set of tires left, so we're going to wait to put those on. I had nowhere else to go, so. All good. Yeah, we're just all on top of each other there. And somebody pit, though, so that's going to put us in P11, it looks like. Still much too early for me. Yeah, that was good racing with you guys. Real good racing while we were green. Thanks. I saved a little bit of fuel. Yeah, it was fun. We can just make it, it looks like. We're probably plenty fine, really, but... Can't hurt. And I doubt this is going to go green to the end anyway. We got to be ready in case it does. Uh-oh. 
Did the three exit a closed pit? Looks like he might have. Unless these guys were already going to the back. They might have uh, already been in front of the field and just needed to go back as uh, lap cars. That might have been all it was. We are thankfully on the lead lap right now, just outside of the top ten. Which is great. I'm very happy with that. Especially after that very messy start we've had. We're under caution. Pits are closed. I think this might be our first time starting on the inside, so I'm going to have to be prepared for that. Are you getting waved around? Twice? Yeah, I just watched the fellas. That was just a combination. I was getting a little bit messy. He's going to be going around. Left us three. Car by. One to go. Next time by. Okay, You'll be Delta. lining up on the inside. Get ready. at the end of this lap. Not quite lined up yet. There we go. Get ready. Going green. This is the farthest we've been up starting in quite a while. You're outside. Get, oh, wow. Oh, no. Yikes. That almost wrecks it. Car inside. Clear. He got a little sideways on that entry. I was really worried. I was watching him. <laughs> Trying to catch it. I was worried he was going to end up in my door. But he caught it. I don't know if we can move up much further than this. This might be right about where our speed is. If the, if, if even this, because we do have Dan right behind us. The lap time was at 18.6. Oh, Chad's spinning. He catches it. Just barely, I think, before hitting the wall. Maybe he still got it. But we are green still. He didn't go completely around. You're in the top right, ten. We are in the top ten now. About a second behind us for Gap. Mitch is in the lead, sounds like. That's good consistency. Not sure what's been happening up front. There's been any uh, contact or anything. But still a lot of the guys you would expect to be there up there right now. Oh, that Lincoln really screwed me up. <laughs> Ooh, Alan Luce. <laughs> I kind of had a sympathy loose of my own. Watching him do it. Entered a little bit too high there.
go ahead, Tyler. Got ourselves a pretty decent green run going on right now. That's good. Thank you, Nick. Feeling all right. Still a little bit nervous. Yeah, no problem. Since I'm unfamiliar with the car. Definitely wants to get loose on exit. Your last lap time was at 18.7. Not sure how we would even pass anymore. We think we'd have to need we need some mistakes probably since we're so close on speed to the guys in front of us. Maybe tires will come into play, I'm not sure. Hasn't felt like too much, maybe a little bit looser on exit. That's all about all I'm feeling. When it comes to tire wear. And that could just be the heat. Tire heat as well. You've just done a 18.7. Oh, he's in the wall. There's that mistake we needed. Thankfully, I'm able to uh, react in time. He apologizes for it. That's all right. A little bit of a skipped beat of my heartbeat, but we go around and it all works out. Easily could be us next. It's very easy to get that wall, especially out of turn two. Go by uh oh. Um, we got a caution. Sorry, fellas. It blew right there, and I like, tried blowing it down to get the that lane. I wasn't gonna make it. Just try to up the car. So, what do we do here? Line up single file behind car number 95. It's been a while since our last pit, but got a lot of race left. I think we might pit. Ah, oh, that's a lot of track position to potentially lose, though. What oh no, we gotta get, we gotta like right by. No, okay, we're good. That little thing uh, on the back stretch, if you hit it, you just the car's dead. The leader, Dronowski, is pitted. Said I had no damage then. I thought about it. A lot of guys did go. Either way, you really couldn't pass here. Tires weren't feeling that bad, so I'm I'm okay with this decision. Unlucky. Car 44. Got the lucky dog. Let them past on the outside. Let that Who's going to be the first person behind us on fresher tires, though? It's looking like the guy at the 24 back there has actually got really much fresher tires. He didn't just pit, but he may have put himself in a good position. Behind him, Dan and Alan still on the same tire sets we are, essentially. Tracy was in that, I guess. He's a lap down now. Oh no. So I'm on pit road. That really stinks. 
we're really gonna have to test uh, our launch here because it could be some tire spin. Seems like not so bad though. So we're gonna save our tire set. We're gonna be slower than the fastest guys, but they've got to get around a couple people first. I think the first guy in new tires is probably Mitch down in 11th. I don't know if we still got people coming around that are getting laps back or anything. Well, hopefully we can get ourselves a good launch, and we'll see what happens with those faster guys coming up through the field. It's going to be dangerous for them for a while, though. Get ready. Going green. Hopefully we can even see I Wesley. Get single file, that's good. Car inside. Clear. 24's got those better tires. I imagine he's going to want to get around us. We'll run our line and there he'll find a way around. Especially with me being a Huge handful here. Your lap time was 18.6. We're kind of lower on exit out of four. I don't know if I would really like that as much. Huge dive to the inside. I hope this guy's patient. He shouldn't have too much trouble getting by us. That lap time was 18.4. I wouldn't think, but maybe tires just really don't matter too much. Not as much as you would think. I say that, but of course, here comes Cade. <laughs> Ask him if the tires matter. Then again, maybe they don't. Maybe it's just Cabe. And that's what matters there. Gets to our inside. Leader's getting wrecked. Can't see. No idea what's happening. Okay, you're in second. Hold your line. Inside, two wide. Hey, what's happening? Hit. Two wide. Inside, two wide. Two wide. The yellow flag is out. Well then. Hey, we've been hit again. And now we have wheel damage. So that's cool. Jeez, guys. Next going in. I'm saving my set of tires. Until they really matter. Doing okay here. I have no idea what happened. We ended up three wide at some point because remember the, the two leaders got into each other and then I think it was Wesley maybe that got sideways and I just I straight up couldn't see what was happening. I was just holding my line 
up top, just kind of hoping. And then I was getting run into because they were probably trying to avoid things and things were happening to the low side of us. I just straight up couldn't see. So. <laughs> I just came. Uh, let's see. Let me not hit the wall under caution by texting and driving. Are open. Man, typing with one hand is while driving is hard. And closed. Pit road is closed. Race car is out. Pits are closed. Yeah, no idea what was going on below us. I hope I at least held my line. I think I did. So we'll be on the outside front row here. Hopefully we can see, speaking of seeing, hopefully we can see well enough inside line. See Chris when he does his launch. Guy's not understanding old tires, it sounds like. I mean, it's pro that's probably me. That probably describes me. But, <laughs> hopefully not. Try not to be the next guy. Making mistakes. Uh, this is it's gonna be hard for us to even launch. Pace carries off. Oh my god. The next car's the leader. P three. Car inside. Still there. Shoot, I got more damage than I thought. Shoot, I got more damage than I thought. I'm gonna go outside here. Still there. Clear. I was like, oh, what the hell happened? No idea. I didn't think I get got hit that hard, but I'm off pace. Well, that sucks. Yeah, you can see how far they're pulling away on these straightaways. That's not good at all. I'm trying to compensate, driving in pretty hard, and I can hold the throttle a little harder on exit. Since I'm not going as fast, but not ideal. Something's really wrong with this car. Oh, whoa. 24. He's got damage now all of a sudden. Oh, he's cut in front of me. Oh, shoot, we're three wide. I don't want to be. The driver in front of us is Dronowski. Inside. Still inside. We just gotta hold on and hope for another inside. caution. Okay, we needed that. Oh boy. Race cars out. Line up single file behind car number zero seven. We think that Johnson has stacked it. We're under caution. Pits are closed. Hopefully we can get some of this damage fixed, because that is not good. Can we tighten up here? Pit road's open. Pits are open. This damage we have is not good. Look out for the 
Hit speed limit. Watch your speed oh my god, he almost just hit the barrels. <laughs> it's tricky pit road, it really sneaks up on you. <gasps> so, understandable, I'm just glad I didn't do it. Right here. We can only repair some of the damage. Taking our tires. Oh my gosh. Man, almost four minutes of optional for some reason. Did you hit the gate? The gate's not in front. I hit the gate and I have instant tool. Probably 30 minutes are required or something. It's probably giving me no warning on. I'm just going to the next corner. Up. Close the motor. Yeah, it blew up. It's probably what was the same deal as uh, the, the Myrtle Beach. They get the oil paint over the bumps and it would blow up, but I don't know why it's doing that with this. Yeah, I wonder if we did get that issue. It's right around here. I would have liked the spotter to give me a warning because I would have hopped off track. I just I went down the straight, noticed I had engine damage to down, blown up. Well, we'll see how much pace we have still. We got our final set of tires on. Let's just try to get what we can. I think he's probably right, though. We probably did get that gate, because that's right around where we were kind of getting involved in that stack up wreck kind of thing that was happening we were right by the wall where the gate apparently is giving people issues so thinking maybe we got shoved into the wall and maybe even clipped wherever the issue was with the gate right around here sounds like it sticks out farther than it should and it's been ripping up the right fronts of guys cars or other places on the right side of the car even but that's really unfortunate because I, I didn't think we had that much damage and we were in bad shape. Hopefully uh, it's a little bit better now. We fixed a little bit of it. We were okay in the corners. We just uh, lost a lot of speed on the straights, which was not good. About to go green. Stay focused. Post car is off, time to do your job. Green, 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 green. B13. Okay. Wow, it's slow. On these straightaways. Yeah, I saw. It's no big deal. It's just that was just a really unlucky stack up. We were just the weakest link in that bumper car train. We we're having some terrible luck here. This car has been thrown into a blender. Somehow it still is moving forward. There's so many people that have been knocked out of the race, I mean, at the very least. We can uh, scavenge something decent, hopefully. I really should have gotten more damage fixed, but I was worried about catching up to the field. And Nick said he was shortening as well. So. Yellow. It's 
Get around the lap cars now that it's telling us to go in front of them. It's closed. I think we'll be on the inside. Looks like it. P17. We just gotta hope we can get as much as we can out of this at this point, because we've been knocked around all over the track. This were if this were an official race, we'd have 20x right now. Not ideal. A little bit of blinking ahead. Let's grab some extra spice. Go green. Oh, no. Let's get this little catch up spot here. Green, 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 let's go. Car out the And they're wrecking. I don't know what's happening. I don't see who's wrecking. Still there. Car in front is Augustin. Not gonna do that. Oh, this speed down on the straightaway is so unfortunate. Oh my god, where's Tyler? <laughs> Clear high. Clear and they're wrecking. This is messy. It's very messy. The pace car is out. Line up single file behind car number twenty. That looks like some major pits back there, though. So probably people out of the race. We're up to fifteenth. So we gained a couple more there. Pit road is now open. Pits are open. That's been run into, it sounds like. We got some people taking tires. Wow, I'm surprised guys had tires. Ah, uh, that sucks. Ellen was having a good run. Man. I gain a couple more spots there, but guys are going to have fresh tires back there. You had the position when the yellow flag came out. Getting hit under yellow. Pace car is out. Pits are closed. I'm really fond of that guy. Same guy who wants to race me as a lap car can't pace either. I guess. One lap to green. Get ready. Line up Race the at the end of this lap. I guess with the short track series, you're going to get short track tempers. I guess that just makes sense. The pace car is in. Green flag. Struggling to get up to speed. P13. Ah, oh, sucks so bad, Evan. Getting down on power. Like, we can get alongside him, and then the, we're just not alongside anymore once we get to the straight away. Outside, 
Trying to do everything I can with what I have. Clear high. Car outside. BK low. There is a car on the high side. Still there. Outside is clear. Outside. Keep low. Outside clear. Contact ahead. Put four up by the wall. I had to turn hard left to make sure I didn't get into him. Augustine, he's reeling you in. The gap's now 1.3. They go on the straightaway. Fifteenth is still not so bad. I guess if even if we watch them drive away, if we can hold on to this after everything we've been through, that would just be just fine. It would be great just to get this thing finished. And uh, bring it home. What's left of it anyway. Someone's in the wall hard up there. It's a pink car. Zero nine. That's Daniel. Another pink car down low. That is Chad. He's gonna get right back by us though, because he's got an actual functioning engine. That was that gate. Is that the gate thing they were talking about? Looks like the gate claimed another victim. Pass the car. Wow, so that's what you guys are talking about. That's really it's crazy. Closed. It's closed. Pace cars out. Line up single file behind car number 17. What are these things idle at? Anybody know? Huh. That was... 1780. Wow, that's really bad. <laughs> Aries has right, got to okay, fix that. It's are open. Yeah, it's 1600. I hit the gear a while back. Yeah, I don't know why these things are so bad. Like they're way off of how they are in real life. They spin the tires. Just figure out. Turn very good. We're down on power. They get a lot of damage when really in real life, not too much. Oh, well, I brushed the wall, didn't even hit the gate, and the guy on the inside of me went flying like he hit the gate. Jesus. Yeah, they gotta fix the tire model on these or whatever. Because I remember in the Snowball Derby last year, you could just take right side tires the whole time and it was faster. And you're like, what, what the hell? Like, how does that make any sense? Oh, it's still that way. Yeah, I realized that's what Mitch did. And I'm like, how the fuck is he so much faster? But I'm like, yeah, whatever. I forgot. That's how a little bit. We're under caution. Pits are closed. Yeah, so, uh, we pass another person, I guess because of this uh, gate. <laughs> That was wild. It looked like he wasn't even close to anything there, and then, uh, flying in the air. Yeah, I probably haven't ran a super light race since then, so I'm like, well. The tire models on these are so way off. Like, you could be wide open in the center in real life and fly flags, so and then here, in our racing, you have to be at the self-finish line, so it's like, what? Okay. Get ready, going green. There's, there's no slip in the tire. I don't know why we're on the outside if we're in P13, but... That's where it says we're supposed to be. Yeah, we're like, you can't get this entire. P12. Inside. Clear inside. Inside. Car inside. Clear. 
that lap was at 18.9. Colton, as your car yeah, I blew up. up. I got off the track. We just we can't do anything because we every, anytime we gain some distance through the corner, we just lose it all on the straightaway. Hopefully, other cars will be back. Cars side by side up ahead. The car in front of us is now shot. V12. Whoa. Car out of dodge. There's a car rejoining. Still there. Outside is clear. Alright, get around Dan. He let us by, though. I would blame him if he took that back later. So I watched the replay of that. I was well below the 09, uh, and my car just flipped through the air. Nowhere near the gate. That was the weirdest thing I've ever seen. Yeah, I have no explanation for that. I'm, I'm assuming that's what everyone's talking about with the gate thing, but it really looked like you were in the middle of nowhere. That lap was at yeah, I was I was in the middle to the bottom part of the track. I'm closer than the Irish, and they're still be like, what the hell? We need to fix this. Which I know why that gate's doing it. So I don't think it's the track, I think it's just more of a car. How it puts into the wall and gets in the wheel wells and stuff. That yeah, was frustrating because that's the best run I've ever had in the uh, on the pavement here. Last lap time was at 18.8. <laughs> Okay, Colton, the next car is Lantos. Yeah, that's not very fun for uh, Alan. I racing just said that's not allowed to happen, I guess. Inside. Clear inside. Go low. Car inside. Still there, inside. Clear. Well, that time Netcode said that somebody, I think it was Tyler, hit the gate, and he didn't actually hit it. But on my screen, he was flipping through the air, and I slammed on the brakes. <laughs> That's crazy. That gate just shot you know, just a bad spot for it. Well, now we lose a couple of spots because of that. No, that was the 18, I think. No, yeah, the 18 that we saw flying through the air. Looks like they got a couple issues to figure out with this track that uh, have become apparent once we've started doing a long race here. Holy dive, Bob. P13 is still not bad. We've got uh, 12 to go. Let's see what we can get. Trying to manage this slow car. Mitch, have you taken right sides at all this race? Or have you taken left sides at all? Nah. Interesting. Apparently right yeah, sides are not necessary. Kind of like the 87 cars. Or left sides, whatever I said. <laughs> One in the wall. B13. What's going on there? 
someone just flanked ahead of me and hit the gate, but didn't. Just keep, I'll just get the crap out of me. Yeah, I'm thinking that's what happened to me. About to get lapped by Mitch, looks like. Inside. This guy's back to try to pass us as a lap car. Of course he is. Clear. You know what, go ahead. Go past some people. Many laps down with five laps left. Great idea. We can move up. Okay, Colton, push now. We'll catch up here. I am not thrilled. This guy's here. What happened? Was it the netcode thing again? Two laps remain. No, you were pretty yawed out. I was afraid to get on the gas. Oh, okay. I don't know about that. Wish we could have at least had a better shot at trying to go around the three here, but Inside. Yep, of course. <laughs> we get alongside him, but no power left in the car, so. B thirteen, there's the checker flag. Alright, there's the checkered flag. Okay, we'll get him next time. You go ahead and hit me. I mean you're the one that's lapped down the entire race running into me for no reason. Thanks, Daniel. <laughs> what a fucking moron. But whatever. 7982. That one, uh, that one was frustrating. Would have been better with a couple people not there, but, uh, oh well. There's going to be too much stuff to see for incidents, and uh, I kind of don't really feel like talking anymore. I'm pretty mad, so uh, we will go ahead and look at the race results page. Now my paint scheme show up. All right, here we are, Mitch, with the fastest lap and the win. As soon as I went back to say good win. There we go. And uh, there we go. There's your finishing results, Mitch, in the with the win here, Cabe, and then of course guys like Tracy probably should have been up there too, but there was all kinds of weird things happening with like the gate and everything and. Who, who even knows what else? I know that we had some weird scoring issues at some points. All that. And then uh, we have the 17 lap down guy issue who wants to door us and do all the other garbage. So 
Man, um, what were your tires at the end since you didn't take less? Hopefully I uh, don't have to race against him anytime soon again. But we get uh, P13, which is really nice considering what we went through. 20 incidents. Um, the only person with more was uh, our good friend right here, which I'm sure is just a coincidence. But that'll do it for this one. Um, a lot of fun despite everything. Um, and still looking real, uh, forward to the season. But uh, that'll do it for this one. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.